The downturn in the UK car market has provided some interesting purchasing characteristics. <laughs> And today we're going to capitalize on those buying opportunities to bring you the rich reviews five supercars you can drive for free the five supercars we'll be featuring aren't prioritized in any order so they'll just come as they come the first car we're featuring on our supercars you can drive for free is the Ferrari 458 Italia. The Ferrari 458 was produced from 2010 to 2015 with some later cars registered in 2016 and of course the Ferrari 458 is the last naturally aspirated V8 mid-engine supercar for Ferrari and of course it's the last supercar for Ferrari that was designed by Pin and Farina. 562 brake horsepower 0 to 62 in 3.4 seconds and a top speed of 205 miles per hour. The lower end of the 458 Italian market is currently just over £100,000 and this aligns with the upper end of its predecessor, the F430 market. That's the one with the F1 gearbox, not the manual edition, because the manual edition of the 430, of course, commands a substantial premium. Of course, the most sought after specifications of the Ferrari 458, 458 Italia are those that are going to be those that are most sought after with the current marketplace. That is pretty much as it always has been. So specifications such as Rosso Corsa over a black interior or Rosso Corsa over a tan interior or TDF blue exterior over a tan interior or Giallo Triple O Strato with a black interior. Those sort of specifications are going to command the value. So with a Ferrari 458 being the last naturally aspirated mid-engine supercar Ferrari and the last supercar that was designed by Pininfrino, these items provide some assurance that the 458 will always command a premium and will always at least stabilize. In the future, supercars that were designed between 2010 and 2017 are going to be known as the golden era of supercars. And those supercars are always going to command a higher premium. And of course, the 458 Italia sits smack bang in that period. <laughs> second car on our list of supercars you can drive for free is the Mercedes SLS AMG. The SLS AMG was produced between 2010 and 2015 so it had a parallel production run to the Ferrari 458. The SLS AMG was designed in homage to the masterpiece that is the 1950s 300 SL and as such in its coupe form shares the same stunning gullwing door design. With the SLS designed within the golden era of Mercedes and with its alignment with the 300 SL this should assure its stability in the marketplace and indeed it should increase in value and should definitely be a car that you can buy now and drive for free. The next car featured on a list of supercars you can buy and drive for free is the McLaren 675LT. The 675LT was produced between 2015 and 2017 and is a raw track edition of the 650S. 666 brake horsepower, 0 to 62 in 2.9 seconds with a top speed of 205 miles per hour. McLaren said they were only ever going to make 500 versions of the McLaren 675LT in coupe form and then they went and made another 500 in spider form. However, we feel that unlike the 720, the 675LT will hold its value due to the rarity in the marketplace, whereas the 720 holds its value due to its pure bang for buck performance. With the 675LT heralded as one of the best McLarens ever made and due to its rarity in the marketplace, we feel that this is definitely one of the supercars that you can purchase now and drive for free. If you're enjoying the video so far, please give the video a thumbs up, give it a like, very important for our channel. And if you like our style of content, please think about subscribing. 
The next car featured on our supercars you can buy now and drive for free is the Porsche 911 991.1 GT3. The 991.1 GT3 was produced between 2013 and 2015, has a brake horsepower of 475, a 0 to 60 of 3.5 seconds, and a top speed of 195 miles per hour. What makes the 991.1 GT3 a very good buy is the fact that its predecessors, the 996 and 997, are holding their value very well at a same about the same price as the 991.1 at between 80 to 100 thousand pounds yet the 991.1 gt3 has far superior technology items such as its advanced pdk dual clutch transmission gearbox and rear wheel steering with the 991.1 gt3 a far superior car to the 996 and 997 it depends on what your driving criteria is with regards to purchasing a gt3 are you looking for more of an analog driving experience or are you looking at more an advanced more modern driving experience and especially with the 991.1 GT3 at so well priced, that same price as its predecessors, we feel that the 991.1 GT3 is definitely a supercar you can buy now and drive for free. We previously reviewed a 991.1 GT3. I'll put a link in the description below. car featured on supercars you could buy now and drive for free is the Ferrari 430 Scuderia. The 430 Scuderia was released between 2007 and 2009 and is the track focused edition of the Ferrari 430. 503 brake horsepower, 0 to 62 in 3.6 seconds and with a 200 miles per hour top speed. When looking across the classifieds, none of the 430 Scuderias have been dropped in price at all. That's a good marker for prices going forward. However, the 430 Scuderia was kept in the shadows because it was released during a downturn in the economy. And then as we were coming out of the downturn in the economy, of course, Ferrari released the 458. And the 458 being substantially leaps and bounds forward over and above the 430, it really kept the 430 and the Scuderia in the shadows. However, when you consider the 360 Challenge Stradale is around the same price now as the 430 Scuderia and the 430 Scuderia is far superior in every way to the 360 Challenge Stradale and the fact that the 458 Speciale is over twice the price of the 430 Scuderia, this really makes you realise what good value for money the 430 Scuderia is and how it's very likely to increase in value going forwards. It's for these reasons that we feel that the 430 Scuderia is a great car that you can buy now and drive for free. We previously reviewed JM on Cars 430 Scuderia. I'll put a link in the description below.